Okay, guys, part three, we're going to wrap this up. Here is our blog. We last left off where we had updated the header file. Now it's time that we have the header file. Let's go ahead and replace this embed image with our YouTube video that we want. Now, you can see what I did is what most people do is they go to YouTube, they find the video that they want to use, and they come down here and they grab the embed object code and they put that on their blog and this does this. Now what we're going to do is just a little bit different here now that we got our header done. First thing is, is instead of putting a text, I would like to use this image for my button. Okay, so what we're going to do is, is we're going to, I use a program called Snagit. I thought I had it coming up, Snagit here, let me double click it here. Okay, and you can go to I'm not sure what the URL is. Just go Google snag it and it'll come up and you can get a 30 day free trial. If you're gonna be doing a lot of videos and a lot of copying to your screens, this is an excellent program. I want region. I'm gonna hit capture. Let me move this text. Oops. Move this text file out of the way. I see a little copied that, and that's not what I wanted. So we'll do it again here. Now we got this. Nope, it still ain't out of the way. Okay, let me stop this for a minute. Let me move all my screens around here this time we got it okay and, and I think you can see part of it it actually highlights and balloons part of the screen which is great if you want to get a real precise picture which is what I'm trying to do here and now we have it now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save it and I've already actually done this once guys so what I'm gonna save it is info one and I'm gonna hit cancel here because like I said I've already done this but this is what you would do and then now what we're going to do is, is we're going to go to our FTP program, which is FileZilla that I'm using. And let me bring it. And what we're going to do is we're going to go to your domain. And you want to go to your image folder. And then what we're going to do is we're going to navigate wherever we saved it on our local computer. Uh, which for me, and let's see if I can't manipulate the little windows here a little better. Let's see here. I saved it on my D drive. I have a new folder I created specifically for making videos and for my SEO blog. And we come down here and we'll just take the video or the image and drop it over here. Now it's going to ask me if I want to replace it because I already have it. I'm just going to say no because I don't need to re-update it. Now what we're going to do guys is we're going to go to the back to the light window and they will give us the code that we need to to do a file for uh, the video now guys what I did is I kind of cheated a little bit because I liked the the window that they had for this little demo right up here and I will have this already set up so you don't have to do what I'm going to show you. But this is a cool trick here, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to View. I'm going to go to Source. And I'm going to come down here until I find... And you can do a search for probably the fastest way, but I just happen to know where it's at, where it says YouTube. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this line. And then we can get rid of the Source file. We don't need it anymore. And I'm just going to open up a text file. And you'll find I use a lot of text files, guys. So we're going to paste that code in right there in that text file. Now, what we need to do is we need to go to YouTube and we need to get the video that we want to put. And we need to modify this because we really don't want the video to come up with the one for 300. So we're going to go to YouTube and navigate to it. And then what you want is you're going to copy this URL or you can come over here and just copy it over here either way we're going to go back to our notepad file and we're going to come down here and we're going to copy it now I'm going to show you what I did originally and I stopped the video and had to go learn what I did wrong and I'm just going to we're just going to leave that here what I'm going to do is go up here and we're going to replace their YouTube video where it says YouTube here with what we copied now what we're going to do guys we're going to go to our blog back to our blog here and now we're going to log into my account I've already got my dashboard opened up and I've already got it so that I can edit it make sure you're in HTML and what I want to do is I want to replace this embed code with this new code 
So I'm just going to grab from here to here, copy it, and then we're going to come down to here and we're just going to replace this. Now I haven't changed the text or anything, so it's going to show, it's still going to say, you know, 300 preview, and that's okay for right now. So we're going to hit save it, and it should update here in a second. And then what we're going to do is, okay, it updated, Now we're going to go over here, and we haven't updated here, so let's update here. And this should be gone now, and it should just have a little text link there. And you see it did. Do you see how fast that loaded with that text link compared to with the video? Now, if we click the preview button, it opens up a nice little window. But looky here. It, let me mute that. It actually opened up more than my video. It opened up the whole channel for YouTube. And when I originally was making this part of the video, I was like, ah, how come it did this? You know, and so I had to go do a little research and figure out how to fix this. So let's close this back. Let's go to our notepad. Let me put it up here. And what I discovered is, is there's two things that we, we need to modify this just a little bit. And what we do is, is see where it says watch. We're going to take and delete that. And then see where it says equal here. We're going to delete that and put a backspace. Now we're going to recopy this code here. And then we're going to go back to our listing here, our post here. And then we are going to just replace this code again. We could have just edited it here. I just find it easier to replace the whole thing. We're going to edit it now. Come over here. Now we need to refresh this so it has the right code in here. Now this time when we do it, looky here. We got just my video without the channel and all the other stuff. And this is what I was really wanting. And we could hit play and it would start playing and all now let's do is let's get rid of this text and again guys this little thing you're seeing right here is I have internet download manager and that's why it's popping up it wants to know if I want to d download the video so now let's replace this text with a image that we saved earlier so what we're gonna do is is guys I'm I'm famous for kinda cheating and stuff this is a little test page I was experimenting with a while ago and you can do this you can go to your image folder and what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down till we find the image file that we uploaded a while ago, which I called it Intro 1. Now, we're going to right click and I'm going to go to Copy Location. And then we're going to open up our notepad here. And what we're going to do is we're going to come down here and we're just going to paste it in here right now. Now, what we need to do is, is I will give you this other little piece of code that you need, guys and it is right here and what you're going to do is I've already inputted this but what you want to do is take this image location put it between these two quotes here and then you can set the height and the width to whatever you want okay and let's say you know we might want to make it smaller uh, let's just for the grins and giggles we'll make this 300 and make this 150. Now I have no idea how this is going to look, guys, because I'm doing this kind of live here. So now what we need to do is let's get rid of the text. So what we're going to do is the title right here. We want to. I'm going to change this to MC Big Boys SEO uh, Intro. And then what we want to do is see right here where it says strong. This was a bold statement. I want to go all the way to here oops all the way to here get the W as well and all the way to this first less than sign and delete that and now we're gonna take this string of text and we're gonna copy that and we're gonna put it in between the two arrows now now we're gonna copy this whole thing and if I did it right we should have a thing and my time is almost up here I'm trying to keep these under 10 minutes paste it save it it's saved go over here we'll update now we should have an image in here and we do have an image in here like I said the resolution or the image size click it and it does work there you goes guys the trick for doing lightbox welcome or thank you have a great day